10 News is back. A Phoenix man is now part of medical history. He is the first patient ever to be treated by a new technology that targets recurring brain tumors. This breakthrough procedure is the first of its kind in the world. Justin Lum is live from Barrow Neurological Institute with the exclusive story. Justin. John Kerry and a first for brain surgeons here at the Barrow Neurological Institute who we met with and they showed us this medical technology firsthand. It's changing one Phoenix man's life. William Richardson found out he had a brain tumor back in 2014. Seven surgeries and multiple infections later, he still remained optimistic. But last December, Richardson was diagnosed with another brain tumor. And then, you know, it was recommended by the tumor board here based on my MRI and history that, you know, I use this machine. This is the ZAP-X, a new form of non-invasive technology to treat brain tumors. The patient wears a plastic mask and is placed in the machine where radiation therapy uses pinpoint beams on the brain. Targeting and giving the high dose just to the tumor without much dose going anywhere else. So it's pinpoint, it has sharp edges, it doesn't give much radiation to the rest of the brain or tissue. Doctors can monitor the patient from different angles as the sphere inside the Zapex rotates. Richardson is the first patient ever to be treated with this system. It almost seems too easy, you know, just to lay in there and have the procedures and, you know, I'm fine. I feel great now. Richardson doesn't have to worry about infections or long recovery time. Barrow surgeons have been operating the Zapex for about a month now and hopeful this alternative can help patients avoid surgery. And over time, we hope to help uh, the Zap uh, Corporation refine this further and further to make the treatment safer and safer and, and uh, faster. Richardson calls this process a piece of cake. Back to my normal life and pretty rewarding there. So what's next for Richardson? He says in a few weeks he'll get results and see how much he has progressed since using the Zap X. So we wish him the best. Live at St. Joseph's Hospital, Justin Lum, Fox 10 News. Thanks, Justin.